Alright then, hello. Yep, we're back to Escape the Backrooms Part 2, and we're just going to be continuing using our second save. We left off at level 3, the electrical station, and I think that is where we came from. Yep, that is level 2, we do not want to go back to level 2. So yeah, pretty simple, let's just proceed here. I don't think there's anything here. We have no items. Oh no, we actually do. I thought we didn't for some reason, but no, we do. We do have items. We do clearly have items. And yeah, we obviously cannot do anything here. Yeah, we obviously cannot do anything there. We cannot progress. So the only logical step is to go here. And to basically solve these puzzles. Turn on the generators. What's going on, man? Okay, lightning. I don't need drama right now. I'll answer you later. Bro, not right now, man. Who is Croatian Patriot, anyway? Okay, we solved one puzzle, so where's the other one? Maybe in here? Yeah. Okay, this is pretty simple as there are no dangers just yet. But the sanity does go down a lot faster in this level. Level 3 is way more dangerous, and I mean way more dangerous than level 2. I would say it's about the same as level 1, but in terms of sanity draining, yeah, it is a lot more dangerous. Alright, we actually got everything already. Easy. Alright, we got all of them here. Yep, really simple. Uh, as you can see, yeah, we got three green on top and six red. So now we need to go to the second section. There's, I just want to see, is there anything else in here? Maybe some more almond water? You know, why not? Nah, there's only this section. Yeah. Oh, an energy bar. Yeah, pretty cool. I like this area. It's pretty, pretty cool. Just the, gr just the bricks, and the maintenance tunnels, and the um, uh, electrical. Basically, it's basically like a massive electrical generator station. Is it because that's what it is? It's an electrical station with brick walls and a crap ton of electrical devices. That's basically what this location is, and I very much like the um, uh, location of it. Let's just eat an energy bar. And that is the wrong way. I am getting lost in the maze. No, no, no. I ain't getting lost. It's right here. Easy. All right. So yeah. All right. So there is the third entrance, and here's the second one. Now we do need a flashlight, bro. Thank you. All right. The game is nice enough to give me a flashlight, which we do absolutely need for this next part. First part had no entities. However, the next part does already have to have some entities, and you're gonna find out what this entity is. Except it's not here. Where is it? Oh, I think it spawns later, maybe. Oh, I'll fly another flash there. I don't think... I don't think there's anything here, right? I'm gonna close this just in case it sneaks up on me. Alright, pretty easy. One down, three, two more to go here. What the heck is it? Should start to show up. Oh yeah, there it is. Hell no, hell no, bro. Hound, chill. Yeah, it's called a hound, and it's weak to your flashlight. It can be stunned three times, and then for some reason it only stunned it twice in a random way. I have no idea why. Anyway, yeah. All right, we still need two more of these puzzle things. We still do need two more. We still need two more. Alright, there's one.
Alright, not, nothing here. Let's just go then. Oh, hell no, hell no, bro. No, 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 no. Bro, bro, bro. Chill. Chill. Do this quick, do this quick, because there's a stupid hound there. Alright, good. Where'd it go? Where'd it go, bro? Where the heck did it go? Where'd Ducky go? I actually don't want to find out. Oh, hell no, hell no, hell no. Alright, chill. Alright, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm kind of done with dealing with these doggies, so yeah. At least they're not unfair like skin stealers. They actually have counterplay. Yeah, I'm just gonna get away from here. Alright, I think I did three. Yeah, I definitely did three. Alright, let's just go then. Let's just go. We don't need a frick around here. Let's just move on. The next area though, yeah, the next area is going to be tough, so we should pre definitely prepare for the upcoming madness, which is, yeah, not going to be fun. Alright, easy. Alright, so let's see how much progress we have made here. Yep, three out of three for the second section. All we need is the third section and we are out of here. So it was actually not very long as long as you know what you're doing. Maybe they could have extended it. I think it's the level length is fine now. At least there's gameplay on like level two, so there is that. Yep, blinded and run. Per pretty. Yep. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Alright. Yeah. I think- does this one despawn? I think it does. Yeah, it despawns. Alright, easy. <laughs> yeah, these electric puddles are extremely dangerous. They insta-kill you. You do not want to step on them in any circumstance. Where is this doggy right here? Here it is. Oh, uh, yeah, I kind of don't- I want to do a few. Can I just not- is that gonna notice me? Oh yeah, no, it definitely noticed me. <laughs> it definitely noticed me, it definitely noticed me. Yeah, yeah, bro, can you just please relax? Literally AFKing right now, my hand wasn't even on the mouse. Hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bro! That, why did a hound spawn there? Chill! Chill, bro. Chill. Okay, I'm out of there, then. Okay, it's over there. No, 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 Dude! Chill! Chill, bro, please. Dude, chill. Chill! I just wanna move! Bad dog, bad doggy, bad. Bad. Yes. Get, get, get blinded. Chill. Do, do, I do not want to move. Bro! This thing is so annoying. I didn't even move for two seconds and it already noticed me. What the hell? Please, chill. And of course, there is literally... Where is it? Bro, I can't even move. <laughs> this is P gameplay right here. 
Okay, I'm I am freaking out of here, man. I'm freaking out of here. Piece of trash garbage. Where the fuck is it? Where's Hound? Hello. All right, you're there. Can you stop camping that door? Stop camping that door, dude. Just stop. Don't camp the door, you stupid dog. Okay, good. Bro! How- the light seeps through the door? I guess the light seeps through the door. So, so far we have zero. We have... We have zero out of three, guys. Zero out of three! The luck is horrible so far. Completely abysmal. Completely fucking abysmal luck. Bro. CHILL! I can't even move! I just need to make a run for the door. Okay, leave fast. Just leave. I'm gonna make a run for Frick you. Okay, good. Oh, hell no, hell no, hell no. Hell no, dude, hell no. Hell no. Nope. Bro, where are- Oh, fuck, fuck. Fuck. Not good, not good. That, that's very bad. That is- Dude, alright, so yeah, the luck is just horrendous. What's here? The luck we're getting is just abysmal. I literally got zero out of three. So far, just wonderful. Just Did it despawn? I think it despawned or something. Okay, nothing here. Not- Dude! <laughs> Fuck! Stupid! Piece of shit! Are you kidding me? You cannot do me like that. Alright, I'm out. Bye! I'm out of here, bye. Yeah. Yeah. Zero out of three, guys. <laughs> Zero out of three. This luck is so bad. I haven't gotten luck this bad. Like, literally ever. Okay, that just leads back to that dog. So I've checked every single door and nothing. So they all have to be here, right? Otherwise, I don't know. Bro, what? Okay, one of them is here. So are they just all here or something? Or what's going on? Are they just all here or something? Okay, there's one at least. They're all just here. That's the biggest troll. Wow. Well, I mean, that actually makes it kind of easier somewhat. Alright, easy. Pretty simple puzzle. Yeah, these puzzles are not, not very hard, obviously. And yeah, they're all here. <laughs> they they are all there. Well, that, that's actually kind of lucky and unlucky at the same time. Because unlucky because it made me stress, but lucky because, well... Oh, fuck. Yeah, I almost died. Not good.
Hell no, man. Hell no. Hell no. Chill. Okay, I don't think anything is here. I don't think anything. I'm just gonna go out the... The traditional way, I guess. The traditional way out. Through the doggy hole. Where is it? Where's the doggy hole, dude? Come on, man. Where is the doggy hole? Okay, there it is. All right. I think the dog here despawns, so that isn't a problem. However, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh hell yeah, I found it. No, 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 no. please, no, 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 no. Drink freaking water. Drink? Okay, good. Thank God. Alright, and that's it, I think. Jesus, man. Freaking stressful. The fact that all three of them spawned in the same freaking area. Well, that, that makes it both kind of simple and good for us at the same time. Yeah, we need to drink a lot of almond water. I nearly died from sanity. Jesus. Freaking heck. Yeah, and that's it for this level. Pretty simple once you know what you're doing. Not not exactly hard. Alright, let's, let's proceed then. And that's it. Level 3 is done. Now we're moving on to level... Four. Level four, a bunch of offices, one massive office building, pretty cool aesthetic. It's raining outside for whatever reason, should have supplies, except there's literally like no supplies here yet. Locked and locked. Awesome. Almond water, nice. I don't know. Um. Nice, more almond water. Does sanity drop in this level? I don't think sanity drops in this level. Juice? Oh yeah, juice. Temporary- yeah, juice is pretty useful. Pretty damn good item. The HUD door should be here somewhere, so I'm trying to find it. Not here. Well, yeah. How do you do these bunny hops, man? How the heck do you do bunny hops, bro? What's outside? I can't tell. I don't know. Looks to be maybe some kind of street here on some massive office building. Yeah, there's literally zero danger here, obviously. Oh yeah, oh, I found it already. Yep, alright. I found the HUD door pretty good. Found it. Just a nice bonus, you know, finding. Just a nice bonus finding the HUD door. Half of these doors are locked, big rip. Most of them ha don't have much, so yeah.
Interesting, I don't think I ever saw this before. Yeah, sanity definitely does not deplete on this level. And why would it? The only reason your sanity might deplete... Oh, we actually already have all the items, which, yeah. As if you're, as I was saying, as, as if you're some kind of, you know, worker and you're treated like shit in the office, then maybe, yeah, your sanity will deplete by a lot better than that, yeah. I'm just lost right now. Where was that vending machine room? The heck? That's just the hug. Bro, where the heck was that vending machine room at? Am I just retarded? Not here. Not here, bro. I'm getting lost. I'm lost in a maze of the various officers. Yeah, I think probably this is where I came from, yeah. Alright, so let's just solve this puzzle. So, we need to count, I think. I think as I remember, yeah, you need to count how many objects there are. So, how many... There are... F wait, one, two... Five, all right, there are five of them here. Five. How many stacks of books? One, two. Is that it? Is that, I guess, yeah, that's it. Just two. Just two. Tables, so two, three, four. So four tables. And how many chairs? A lot. Wait, so... 10. Set that, yeah, 10, no, 10 is a number, 10 is a number. Alright, pretty simple, yeah. Sixty-four kilobytes of RAM, bro. That is like nineties, maybe even eight, like late eighties now. Probably nineties computer. <laughs> Pretty ass computer from the nineties. Sad, sad man. Sad. Sixty-four kilobytes of RAM again. That's nice. Some more items that we can't pick up because our inventory is already full. Another PC that only has 64 kilobytes of RAM that's on a blue screen for whatever reason. So now the goal is to not be detected by the camera system. It does seem a bit dumb, but that's how it is. The goal is to not be detected by the camera system. Is there anything in here? Nobody, nope. No siree, there's absolutely nothing in here. Well, that's just wonderful. That's just great.
Alright, there we go. I managed to stealth my way through. Level 4, pretty simply. Yeah, level 4, the only challenge was stealthing through the cameras. It wasn't even that hard. Alright, so... I should probably grab a bug spray. Sanity, oh wait. So wait, what do I have to do here again? Uh oh, I don't remember. Oh, wait, for real. Oh no, I think... Oh yeah, no, I remember, no, I remember. You have to press in order from youngest to oldest. You have to basically press this button below the painting. So you're a young girl, obviously, so... You're a fairly young dude, so yeah. You're a really old dude. And you're kind of a middle-aged dude, so that should unlock it. Alright, yeah. That's how you do it, guys. From youngest to oldest, press the buttons of the paintings. Now we have to kill a bunch of male death moths. Yee! A bunch of male death moths, guys. I like the hotel complex. It's pretty cool. Don't, and also don't worry about the section whatsoever. There are no hostile entities. At all. So yeah, not, absolutely nothing to worry about. Can you open these doors? Uh, no. You cannot open these doors. Well, alright. Alright then. I see how it is. Death Mouse, where are you? Come on. Where are the male death mobs at? I want to kill them. For the jelly. Sounds weird as hell, but... That's, that's the goal. Of this entire adventure. In this hotel complex. Is to get... The mob jelly. From the male death mobs. And apparently... They didn't spawn yet. Or they're not here. Well, they're not here. Yep. So I just wasted time. Let's go. No, it's not a waste of time. It's enjoying the atmosphere. Of the hotel complex. And of the game in general. Because I blitz right past... The next two levels of relative ease. I actually didn't... I didn't even die on level 3 one time. Level 4 you can't die, so... Yeah. But level 3 you definitely could. And despite getting kind of lucky slash unlucky, depending on how you view it. Lucky in that they're all close together. Unlucky in that it caused me to stress a lot. Not a lot, just a bit. Death Muffs, where are you? De death mobs? Hello? Okay, for real, I can't even get a single male death mob group to spawn. Bruh, alright, pretty pretty terrible RNG right now. Pretty bad RNG. Well, if, if I could just get one of them, one group to spawn, that'd, that'd be great, but nope. Yeah, I don't think they're in here. Yeah. Alright. I can get a single death muff to spawn apparently. That's just wonderful. They're not spawning at all. I checked in here. They're not in there either. I'll try to check again. Maybe they spawn. Do they spawn yet? Hello? Nope. Nah, they're not in here. Well, yeah. <laughs> They are not in here at all. Male death mobs are not in here at all. Awesome. Awesome sauce. Just wonderful. So, so far we have found zero death male death mobs. Which is not good, obviously, because, well... Alright, there we go. Oh, shit. My sanity is actually going really low. Hello, and bye. Yep, easy. I'm just gonna deposit it here. If you feed, then they will reward you. Well, bye, yeah, huh? 
No, no, I didn't. Holy crap, man. Oh my god, bro. I didn't mean to eat it. I did not mean to eat it. I straight up did not mean to eat that shit. I did not mean to eat them off jail. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> you need to press F. Jesus Christ. Bro, this is... Yeah, they're not responding in a long time, so... Male death muffs in the bathroom. Thank you very much. In the very nice looking bathroom, they were there. They're not here. I just need one more. I just need, hello, male death muffs, come out now. Oh, yeah. All right. Thank you. I can't actually pick this up because, well... All right, then let's just go back. Yeah, I killed them all in there. All right. Second key and perfect. Just great. All right. Wonderful. So let's just proceed then. And now the gameplay actually begins. Now I need to collect papers and put them in here and then I get a code. So yeah, this is not going to be that good. So I guess let's just try to explore. Want to be as fast and efficient as possible for obvious reasons. There's also a skin stealer here along with a hound, so yeah. The hound, it's lucky that the hound spawn instead of the skin stealer because yeah. Okay, nothing here. Hide in here. If a skin stealer comes, hide in there. What? I didn't 
didn't even see it. Bruh. <laughs> that was the funniest death by far. Are you joking? I didn't even see it, man. Alright. Easy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to go in the other way then, since we quite literally found nothing. Completely unproductive sack of shit. Okay, are you joking around, bruh? Fucking... Okay, nothing. I'm the heck down. Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> so we just chill right now. We chill. Sorry that I'm not talking. This part of the level is extremely, and I mean ridiculously, and I mean completely. Focus based. Like, we cannot lose focus even for a single second because if we do, we're dead. Like last time. Yeah. <laughs> if we're dead, we lose so much progress, which will be just devastating.
Yes, dude, we made so much damn progress. Insane. In fact, we just need one more. Yes, guys, one more paper and we're done. Holy damn. So I guess let's try to find it. Let's try to find it. Alright. Fuck it. Making a run for it. Making a damn run for this shit. <laughs> Fuck! God damn it! <sighs> Alright. I just need one more paper though. I just need one more paper. That's it. Where the heck was it? Please, dude. Motherfucker. I'm choking, dude. I'm choking. I'm going the wrong, the wrong way. I think I can go. Where the heck is he? Is he gone or something? I think he's gone. At this point, I just need to make a complete run for it. Okay, nice. Okay. Let's go, dude. I'm cracked at this game. Alright, perfect. What is the code? 17564. 17564. 1 7 5 6 No, no, no. God damn. 6 Four. Yes, dude. Clutch. Bro, no way! Wow! <laughs> Are you kidding me? No way! <laughs> Bro, that was crazy. I was literally opening the door. Wow. Holy. That's like the final freaking goodbye to like just the final goodbye message to like the ultimate freaking. Are you kidding me? Wow.
Bruh, can I just catch a break? Holy damn. I'm so tired of this hotel section, dude. No way. I don't have to do anything. Can I just... Okay, are you kidding me? One. Seven. Five. I need to be fast before this fucking skin stealer catches me again. Now it's a different code? What in the world? The code is random? Are you kidding me? Code is actually random. K. Okay. 05938. Okay, let me just grab this. Zero. Wait, what was the code again? I'm wasting so much time. 05938. 05938. Zero. Five. Nine. Three. Eight. Okay, please, can we just enter? Okay, thank you. Freaking worst luck at the end. A hound and a skin slur in the exact same spot. So now we're here. In the boiler room. What? Yeah, move this here. Now we have a thermometer. Now we'll be asking, what's the purpose of a thermometer? Well, we're in a boiler room, but more importantly, we also have female death mobs introduced for the first time. And what female death mobs do is... They're hot, I guess? I'm not sure how a bug... Can... Make it hot, but okay, I guess? But anyway... We can tell when a female death moth is near based on the heat counter. If it's hot or not, basically. Or well, if I could actually make it past this first room. And not get lost. Because my sanity is depleting. Okay, I just made it back to the start. Wonderful. Just, it's great. It's wonderful. It's awesome. Alright, 140 degrees. Yeah, a female death mouth is very near us. Oh, wait, no. Not a female death mouth. Yeah, I don't want to open that door because that contains a hive. Which will instantly kill me, so no thank you. I I'm not opening that door, thank you very much. There's no female death now, so I guess it's because of the hive temperature, perhaps. Oh my god, this is such a maze, dude. Sanity is depleting like no one's business. Alright, I need to find a way out of this loop, bruh. Shit. Okay, we made I made it out of the loop finally. Finally I made it out of the loop. Holy shit, yeah, here's the female death moth, and I don't want to find out, no, I know, I already know what happens. I already found out once. If you don't crouch next to it, and that's it, you die! You die a brutal death, that's what happens. So I'd rather not.
Yeah, we just want to crouch to avoid these guys because for some reason if we're crouched they cannot see me. But if I'm not crouched or of walking or running next to them or doing literally anything. Not fun. Not a fun experience. Think I can walk now? Yeah. It's, if it says 125, then they're definitely near me. If not, then they're not. So, yeah. Shit. I don't know why I'm crouching, even though it's a 72, but, you know, I don't... Just to make sure, anyway. And, yeah. Got bamboozled. Nice. This area is just a massive maze. Bro, okay, I I'm get it, I lost, I'm lost, man. I should probably not go back. I'm gonna try to find a way of any. I'm just backtracking a bit. Maybe there? What's inside there? I'm gonna check. Nothing. Alright. Yeah, just lost. <clears throat> I'm just extremely frustrated. Where do I go, dude? Where the heck do I go? Okay, I don't know at this point. I'm just going insane from like this level. I just wanted to die. Yeah, thank you, Deathmoth. Thank you very much. Okay, the reason I wanted to do that is mainly so that I could backtrack and also restore my sanity because it was quite low. So where do I go? This maze is driving me freaking insane. Okay, where the heck do I go?
Please, dude. I just need to go somewhat, right? No, 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 no. I clicked it! I pressed F! On that valve, what are you talking about? I pressed F! Why am I having a problem with female death mobs all of a sudden? Why am I having a problem? Apparently now, death mobs are actually a problem. For me. I just don't understand. Why does the moth produce heat? How can an insect produce heat? Well, I guess it's backrooms logic, so... Yee. I didn't even notice. I would've just sprinted, and yeah, I would've been as good as dead. Well, yeah. Can I just please get out of here? I, I'm so tired of this. I am so tired of this stupid shitty ass crab, dude. Just please. Nope, and I'm back here. Fucking piece of shit. Oh, wait! Bruh, that was it. I actually some- I don't even know how. I just- Well. Should I do level fun? Fine, whatever. It's a short level. I'll do level fun, but that's about it, I think. Or maybe not, i just get to level fun, probably. That's it for this video. I think I'm just way too tired to comment on shit. And I don't know how I made it to the exit. I just randomly, like, started walking. I need to watch out for the stupid smiler again. I just started, I just randomly walked through the boiler room. And I somehow got to the exit. No idea how. And apparently death mobs were actually a problem. But I managed to get through it fairly simply. I don't even know how. Yeah, I'm just going to get to level fun, but then I'm just going to end the video there because I'm too tired to continue right now, so yeah. Too tired to actually comment on anything because I'm just so tired from these levels. Like, level 5 was just insane. Level 3 was also pretty stressful. Level 4 was free, obviously. But level 5 is a pretty fun level, actually. Just Of course, they got the excitement of level 2. Of course, you got the excitement of level 2, running from a smiler. Bro, run! Great, my character has... I need to find the level fun door. Okay, we found it. <sighs> Level fun, hooray, we're here. Party goers. Party time. Not not fun. Not party goers are not cool. <laughs> but anyway, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you enjoy your day. Anyway, goodbye.